Hi guys, I'm back with the rehab mindset and I found myself in a little loop um, as into I don't know if it's a stuck mindset or I'm just thinking after rehab, you know, it's only 28 days, I'm gonna leave out of here eventually how I'm going to how I'm going to and how I want to proceed on. Um, and I'm in rehab because I'm addicted to solid foods. I like to eat a lot. And I find myself still going to the store a lot. It's just, I feel like rehab need to teach and give other gateways to be able to cope with that. It's like, there's nothing wrong with eating a lot, but it's just what are you putting into your body is what I'm getting at. That's where it's just like, if you went to rehab, ma'am, for eating a lot, why are you still going to the store so much? I've been buying like all the little good healthy stuff. <laughs> um, and it's like, okay, we're, this is the main part I'm getting at because in rehab, normally people go to rehab because, you know, they have pill problems and things like that. And that's where the dilemma is at in my mind where it's like, what are you doing, ma'am? But it's like, as I was saying, I feel like they should teach us how to operate it better. Like you did taking pills, at least make sure the pills you're intaking make sense. You know, it's, it's more beneficial, which I got to pull out my babies. <laughs> I got to pull out my babies. So I went and got these today and I was, I was sitting there thinking, I was like, oh my God, Jesus. I'm going to get kicked out of rehab because I went and got some pills. Man, what are you doing? You know, but this intake is way more, in, I don't know if I want to say important. That's why I can't even get the words out because it's still like in my brain. It's just like, what are you doing? What are you doing? This intake is so much better. Like I went and got me um, the bone and muscular health. I think this would be great. Definitely with me um, working out and things like that, a body get to hurting. And I've been trying not to take this. this. These are the ones that get you in the rehab normally, just for my mindset. And it's like, I'd rather intake, just the right one, this instead. You know, I think it makes much more sense to me. And then I went and got um, support cellular energy and nerve health. I was like, oh, yes, I want that. Um, and this is another pill aspect, fish oil, which I actually like this a lot. And it's just like, if I have to, I will see. <sighs> I about to say like, bust the pill open and just consume the oil. But it's like, this, this makes more sense to do for the long run. Cause it's like, I could be like going to the store and buying like, greens and vegetables and like blending it but it's like i don't even want to plan an area like a path has already been set for me that i just gotta just follow a suit on it's like it comes in this form you know it's convenient it's healthy it's, it's it makes sense to me but if i was to move from the fish oil i went and got some coconut oil which i actually was like oh my god how lovely i didn't realize how healthy and beneficial coconut oil was honestly I actually got this for a laxative but when I went to go and get me a the V the V the vitamin B pill I realized oh they got coconut pills too I didn't realize it was so healthy honestly so that's just things that I was thinking about as to how I hope rehab learned to work with people with those addictions that's like Really, are you never going to ever use a pill again? What if you have to go to the hospital or something? But there, there's beneficial ways to consume something that you're addicted to, if that makes sense. Even with me, eating solid foods. I'm not eating solid foods, but all my intakes that seem to be bad are beneficial. That's why I don't know if I'm going to share this video. Because like, I feel like a contradictory. It's like it's in my head. But I was like, maybe if I record, it'll make sense to me to get it out my brain. Because I just like, oh, Jesus. I thought about it when I 
first recorded honestly i went back and i watched it and i was saying i know why i vape you know i know there's something on the eternal side me being in rehab they would say i'm probably a bad influence because like the goal is for them to stop not to be like comforted because they know they couldn't do something on the eternal side but it's like it's true you know and then i want to show up with some damn pills knowing you know people have addictions to these well show them the right way to do it then okay like make it make sense <laughs> make it make sense and that's what I, I do and for myself since i came up with the affirmation today as into i hope to stay faithful to myself and this is literally for myself even though i did the overall because i know people are addicted to these type of things I am a pill popping individual. I, in a heartbeat, would take a pain reliever just because I don't have time for pain. You know, I go to work out. You best believe after that workout, I am popping me an ibuprofen. Or the next day, I'm not going to work out because my body hurts. You know? Which I actually be doing good. I have not been taking my ibuprofen. I've just been naturally healing. But it's like, I want all the benefits, honestly, that I can get within this process. Um, I hope I summed that up well enough. But, yeah. <laughs>